we are in Parliament today for the first ever parliamentary reception on fish welfare. We initiated this event. We gathered a range of different animal protection organizations, industry representatives, celebrities and parliamentarians. So we've been really guiding this coalition to give fish the protection that they deserve. There are many MPs and peers in the room, industry spokespeople and retailers, and it's great to see everybody here with the same objective, to see farm fish have increased protections. There's a complete lack of legislation, and we're reaching the point now where there should be legislation for one of the most commonly farmed animals in the UK. Fish feel pain, of course they do, and sadly with minimal monitoring of their slaughter, their suffering can only increase. So what we're doing here today is calling on the government to bring in new laws, update legislation and help protect fish at slaughter, because fish feel pain. I'm Ronnie Souter. I'm Head of Veterinary Services at Scottish Sea Farms, which is one of Scotland's largest salmon farming companies. And I'm here to support this call for legislation to protect farmed fish at the point of slaughter. So it's been good to be involved today and to meet people from different sectors, to meet the parliamentarians who can make this happen and to meet the, the people from the NGOs who have been pushing this and to find that actually we're all moving in the same direction. We've passed quite a lot of welfare legislation in my 10 years in the Lords, all on terrestrial animals. And I'm very well aware that there is a big gap in terms of legislative protection for the welfare of farm fish. Fish feel pain, they are recognised as sentient animals, and so I think there's a strong argument they should be afforded the same legal protection in rearing and slaughtering as our terrestrial farmed animals. Slaughter of fish is an issue that matters to lots and lots of people at the moment. It's down to a voluntary agreement, it's down to the RSPCA assurance scheme. The government needs to get on with it and take some action. Historically, fish have been neglected by the government. It's just a thing that they don't think there is much public interest or political interest in, but we're here to show them that they're wrong about that. People care about this issue. It won't be burdensome to the industry because the industry are on side and everyone wants this. So hopefully this will make it easier for the government to make the legal change that we all want to see.